Hey guys, welcome back. Lindsay Norman and Catherine Auger are here. They're program specialists with um, the Walk and Roll Week, Sunday Streets Missoula, and all around just working with Missoula in Motion to help promote uh, basically not driving. That's the whole idea is like you bike, you can walk, and which is what uh, Sunday's going to do is basically going to kick off um, Walk and Roll Week. So well, let's talk about some of the events that are happening on Sunday to kick it all off. Yes, so Sunday Streets Missoula is our open street initiative where we close down Higgins Avenue from the X's to 5th Street and just kind of line it with free and fun activities that people of all ages can enjoy. Um, so some of the activities include um, we're having yoga on the bridge, we're going to have a tango dancing class, the, the skateboarders at Edge of the World are going to set up a big half pipe and do some skating. Um, there's just going to be like, there's the Missoula Fencing Company is coming, so... Um, lots of fun stuff that really everyone can enjoy. So we're really looking forward to it. It's completely free and um, lots of fun for everyone. And uh, MissoulaInMotion.com is where you guys can go to find out all the information about all the events that are happening as well. Just a quick little access to see it all and whatnot. So um, with Sunday Streets uh, happening, which, which Sunday Streets is this? How many times have you guys done Sunday Streets? So this is the 12th one. We've been wow. doing it since 2008. So what is the what is your favorite part about Sunday Streets? I think really just kind of seeing the community come together. Um, it really is a beloved community event. Last year we had over 10,000 people attend, which is almost 12% of our population. So um, I think it's, it's just really kind of an open opportunity for people of all incomes, all ages. And um, we really just like to see that it's a car-free space. It's um, an, an event where we really take back the street to the people and um, just really enjoy ourselves. So. But not only is uh, Sunday Streets um, kind of like uh, its own event, but also it also is going to be kind of kick it off Walk and Roll Week. So which one of you want to talk about Walk and Roll Week? I'll talk about that part. Um, yeah, so Sunday Streets is kicking off um, our week long of deals, discounts, and events to promote sustainable transportation. Um, so at Sunday Streets, people will be asked to take the pledge to be one less car on Missoula's first ever one less car day, which will be September 20th, so that's next Wednesday. Um, so we're really trying to make that link with sustainable transportation at Sunday Streets. Um, and just to clarify, we're not anti-driving, we're anti-driving alone. So we really like to emphasize that we're not anti-car, we also promote carpooling um, and taking the van pool along with biking, walking, and busing. And I know that um, Missoula Motion were also like had an initiative just this last year moving forward on finding alternative ways of transportation and you have a very interactive website when it comes to that as well. Yeah, definitely. So we have um, an online trip planner, so it allows you to see all of your different transportation options. You put in where you're starting from and where you're going to, and you can see how long each one takes you, um, how much it costs, how many calories you burn, if it's an active mode. Um, so it's really helpful because you can see you know, all the bus routes in one place along with um, different bike routes depending on level of comfort. So if you're more comfortable biking on bigger streets, you can look at those routes, or if you're less comfortable being in the road, you can look at the ones that focus more on the trails. So, so. Um, Sunday Streets um, basically is going from 12 to 4 p.m. on Sunday, which is why it's called Sunday Streets. Yes. And it's going to be basically closed down Higgins, um, but there's going to be some uh, through ways a couple times through like Broadway and whatnot. Yes, so Broadway and 5th Street are both going to remain open to cars, so we'll have um, cross guards that are kind of monitoring Broadway just to make sure that people are only crossing the street with the light, um, but other than that, it'll be completely car free. Wow. I mean, and it goes basically from um, w w like the red X's? Yes. All right. the way till like Big Dipper? To 5th Street, so yeah, I think one block past Big Dipper. Wow. Yep, and we're going to have um, the Missoula Parkour is going to be set up down uh, Unparalleled Movement, I believe is what they're mm -hmm. called, down at um, the X's, and so they're going to kind of use the X's as part of their activity, and then um, we'll have Edge of the World over at 5th Street kind of as the other bookend. Cool. So uh, what other events are happening that you guys kind of want to talk about before we uh, wrap up? Yeah, so for Walk and Roll Week, we have um, different themed deals every day. So um, there are different local businesses giving out discounts and freebies. So Mondays, for example, is Muffin Monday, Taco Tuesday. <laughs> um, so those are all on our website. And then there's a, um, on Wednesday for One Less Car Day, we have a commuter breakfast blitz. Um, so we'll have 10 different free breakfast stations set up at different places around town. Um, so see if one is on your normal commute if you're biking or walking or busing to work. Um, and you'll get free coffee and breakfast treats. 
Um, there's also two big events. We have um, one on Tuesday is on the Unseen Missoula Tour, so the Historical Preservation um, Society or Commission um, is organizing it, and it'll be a tour of some of the um, tunnels under downtown. Um, and so that will be really cool, and seeing some things, some places that you may not even know existed. And then there's also an amazing race, which uh, Mountain Line is coordinating, and that's on Thursday. So teams can sign up and um, see if you can get from point A to point B using sustainable transportation. Um, and then there's prizes and all sorts of fun, fun things along with that. And also you guys um, are going to be at the university for Walk and Roll Week as well? Yeah, they're partnering with us as well. So they all have um, a different raffle um, prize giveaway every single day. So every day you commute sustainably, you can check in in the UC and enter a raffle. And then they'll also have a breakfast split station and a couple other things going on too. Because I always remember that uh, during Walk and Roll Week, which used to be called Bike, Bok, bike walk. Bus, Walk, well, yeah. Same thing. <laughs> yes. um, that you got, that people, uh, you got representatives, bike ambassadors, um, would stand on the corners and hand out like coupons and this and that. And of course, there's a couple other sponsors that also do some stuff. And I know that uh, Taco del Sol also does a sponsoring event for Walk and Roll and has done in the past. It's like, did you walk here? Well, you can get some money off of a burrito or something. Yeah. So yeah. there's a lot of that going on. There's a lot of that. So yeah, every day there's a different theme. So. Check our, check our list online for the different businesses participating, but yeah. All right, so if you want more information, go to MissoulaMotion.com. They'll bring you to all the links to basically everything that you need to know about Walk and Roll Week, including Sunday Streets and more. So is there anything else you guys One want to say? One last thing. We have our big bike palooza which is Missoula's biggest bike ride, and that is taking place Saturday. So that's going to kind of be the end um, big event for Walk and Roll Week. So we hope people can make it. It's at 2 p.m. and it's leaving from Free Cycles, and they're also doing their Festival of Cycles that day. So we really want to get a lot of people. It'll be a five-mile family-friendly ride, so hopefully people can make it. Cool. Well, thanks, guys, for joining me. Um, if you want more information, go to uh, MissoulaMotion.com.